Welcome to Robot Studio Tutorials. Today we will look at how to teach instructions to our robot and edit the created path in the virtual world of Robot Studio. I hope you are all set with your headset connected. Let's get started. You must create a path manually in Robot Studio, to which the taught instructions will be added. We have added path 10 as the entry point for our simulation. Click on the path menu on your left-hand controller. This will display options for creating and editing the targets and instructions in the selected path. Click on Teach and that would display options to adjust task, work object, tool, path, and instructions. We can also see Teach and Record options for creating targets and instructions. We can select the active controller and task. We can see that our task, TROB1, is selected. We can also select the work object to be active, under which the taught targets would get added. Here we have created two work objects, one for the upper workpiece and another for the lower workpiece. We can select which tool to be active if you have more than one tool. We can select the procedure to which the instructions would be added. We can also select which instruction to be added while teaching targets to the robot. Click on Teach, and that would create a target with the selected instruction at the current robot position. Let's teach an instruction at the current position of the robot. Then we can simply grab the tool and jog our robot to another position. Let's try to bring it closer to the left corner of the upper workpiece. We can always align the robot tool orientation with the selected reference. Let's click on Align TCP. Once the tool is aligned, let's teach an instruction just on the top of the workpiece. We will use the constraints to jog the robot to a proper position and click on Teach. We can now see the path created from one target to another. Let's jog the robot down to the workpiece and teach an instruction to the robot. Let's select Move L Instruction from the template. We will jog the robot to the other end and teach an instruction. Similarly, we will teach instructions to create a welding path on the workpiece. Now that our path is created, we can edit it. We can select a target with the right trigger to move it. We can also add an instruction by selecting a point and pressing the right trigger of the right hand controller. Let's insert two instructions. We can also fine tune the targets created. If we wish to delete any targets or instructions, we can select the delete mode and just select the targets or instructions to be deleted. We can also copy the orientation of any frame, tool or part and apply it to another. Select copy or apply orientation from the manipulate menu. Select the object and copy the orientation relative to its parent's coordinate system. Apply the copied orientation to another object by clicking on apply orientation. We can also edit the speed by clicking on Edit Speed. We can select the path segment with the right trigger to edit. Let's reduce the speed of the path. Similarly let's reduce the speed of the complete path.
We can also edit the zone data of the TCP path by clicking on Edit Zone. Select the path segment and let's select zone data as fine. This will make sure that our robot reaches the specified position before program execution continues with the next instruction. If we want to change the robot configuration, we can click on Configurations. We can select any target and select the robot configuration. Now, let's play the simulation to verify the changes we have made to our path. We have successfully created and edited our robot path. We also have an option to continuously teach targets while we move the robot. Select record and grab the robot to move it. Let us move it to some position in the Y direction. You can see that the path was automatically created. Similarly, we can just move the robot and record targets. Teaching instructions and editing path in virtual reality is simple and an amazing experience. What are you waiting for? Get your headset and experience our ABB robots in the virtual world of Robot Studio. Thank you for your time and for more tutorials visit our Robot Studio webpage.